and yet they kill gays and lesbians, they persecute women, they persecute Christians and Jews. How can she take their money, they buy her silence, and then accuse others of the very thing she's guilty of? That's right, and this is a debate, frankly, that conservatives and Republicans ought to be prepared to go head on. I mean, well, let's talk about, if, if you were a gay or lesbian American, who you, ought to, who you should you be for? And when you look at Hillary Clinton's record of taking money from genuinely homophobic societies, you look at the record of, of Clinton and Obama and John Kerry at sending money to Iran, which kills gays, uh, you, have to, you have to say to yourself, there's something so profoundly hypocritical, and that's frankly why I mentioned uh, the Haitian minimum wage. Uh, they pose as though they're the friends of the poor, but in fact, in Haiti, the Clintons were the friends of the rich, and they actively fought against helping the poor. Let me go back to the polling numbers again. Now he's up in North Carolina in a poll by three. He's up in Florida at the poll I just mentioned. He's up in Ohio in two polls now, Colorado and Nevada. Also, you can add to that Iowa. He's close in Michigan, three points in Wisconsin. He's close in Pennsylvania, Virginia. How does he